This is Smart Home Designs. What I'd like to show you today is how to hook up a smart plug, a relay, to a fireplace. Now most fireplaces, if we were to just draw the bottom of it in the compartment area, usually what they have is they'll have a plug in this area. And right around here, there's the gas valve. And right about in here, there you'll see two screws that um, control the pilot for the gas valve. And what most contractors do is they'll come off here and they'll run two wires off that to a receptacle someplace in the room with a switch. So now what you can do is you go to here and you turn on your fireplace. So how can we do this with a remote control system? First of all, what you're going to need is you'll need a, a smart plug. You're going to need some kind of a cable or a plug to actually plug into the receptacle right here. That's already wired in the bottom of your gas chamber or your, your fireplace. And then what you're going to need is some kind of a relay because what this relay is going to do is replace this switch over here. And by replacing this on off switch, the two contacts um, will actually control the gas valve. So what I've done here is I've purchased a Potter Brumfield uh, relay and it's actually a dual pull, dual throw, but I'm only using just the one side of it. As you can see from here, it comes around and makes that contact. So the only two contacts I'm using is these two contacts right in here. On the back side of it is where the 110 will come off the plug. And when I can remote control the plug with my Amazon unit, I don't want to say the name because it'll trigger it. And what we'll do is you will plug this into your smart plug and cause the relay to open and close on command of whatever you name this relay. Here's the other two wires that come off the, the dry contact, and I'll be putting uh, connections on those and actually tying them to these two wires right here. So just to recap, we've got our fireplace that's already wired in. We're gonna plug it into the bottom of the fireplace. Of course, you're, the, depending on how you're gonna remove the, the front of the fireplace, as, as every model is a little bit different. But what we're doing is putting this inside the fireplace. These two wires will now connect in parallel to the two wires that control the switch back here. So now by, instead of me going standing up to control the switch right here, these two wires will actually be the two wires that close this relay from the command of this plug by powering on this relay and the coil. So that's one of the easiest ways to hook up a remote control fire um, box system that has either gas or electric. This is home, smart home designs.